Greetings and salutations, friends, and welcome back to some more Planet Coaster. And I am completely hooked on Alpha 3. Uh, we're actually up to iteration number 2. They've released a, uh, an update which fixes a few minor issues with the uh, Steam Workshop. Um, but, um... I, uh, the other day I let this run. Uh, I added these in to see if I could alleviate some of the choking that I'm getting in the crowd over here. We will have a look at that in a moment. Um, I uh, threw down some trash cans. I found out that trash cans will work if you put them on the outside edge of the path. Because uh, if you put them on the inside edge, they actually, uh, you know, the people have to go around them. So you're essentially making the pathway slightly thinner at that point. So yes, they will. See, there you go. They will actually use them if they're on the outside edge of the path. Same with benches. They will use the benches off if they're on the outside edge of the pathway. Like, like, nope, they thought about it. Shall I sit down? No. And these people, yep, I want to sit down. I'm going to go ahead and take a seat here. Of course, they will leave the pathway to get there. Um, but uh, benches also seem to be omnidirectional, too. Um, when I was looking at this the other day, see, these guys are sitting on it the right way around. So I think what happens is if they're coming from this direction and they see the bench and they want to sit down, they just cut across and come from this angle. If they're coming from this direction and they see the bench and they want to sit down, they will come from this side. Cool. They also seem a little lost. It's time to go home. If one more person bumps into me, I'll pull my hair out. <laughs> Alright, so let's see what's going on over here. Alright, see I was getting a, a lot of choke in this area. Um, if you remember I had this coming down and hooking up here. And basically we had a, uh, like a bit of a see, here we go, it's starting to... We're starting to get a choke again. I don't know if they're stopping to look at this thing or what. But, um, crowds do seem to be getting a little better. Nobody's going up around this way, though. <laughs> um, I'm wondering if it's pathfinding. Uh, this going through here is technically quicker than going around here. So what I could probably do is make this path uh, longer and wider wider. Wow, good job there. Windier. To prevent people from using it as a cut through. So, you know, unless they're actually going to one of the vendors, they will prefer to go around because it's quicker than going through my what could potentially end up being a maze. <laughs> the sun's going down again. Stop! Um, I didn't do much else. I, uh, I need to get rid of this support. Let's go ahead and we'll do that now. Path. I never did... Let me see if I can replace it with this. Path supports. Off. Yeah, they... they. Oh, we have like this tiled dealio if we do that. Oh well, whatever. We'll go with that. Alright, so there we go. The uh, supports are now gone. La 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 la. I should do the same here, but... Can't be bothered, to be honest. I'm not even worried about down this end yet. Because this is going to be for... Uh, Alpha 4. So I need to figure out where the split is. We'll, call, we'll put the split about here, shall we? Right? This should give me plenty of room. Well, sorry, it's not Alpha 4, is it? It's Beta. When this goes into Beta, this is when I get this bit filled out. Okay. So let's put down some kind of a marker of some kind. We'll stick these down. There we go. 
No father. You are no father of mine. Ha! Huh. Sorry. So they are about there. Uh, it's a little more than halfway, but that works for me. Okay, so enough playing about. Um, this time, let's have a quick check of the scenery. Because we've got a lot of updates to the scenery. We've got, for some reason, we've got a giant hamburger. It's kind of weird. And then a patty and you know, the fillings. Pretty odd. And uh, we got some new trees. We got, oh, well, let's... Oh, yeah, I never did check and see if there were any new special effects. What have we got here? Steam. Ooh. Steam jets. Yeah, those I know about smoke. I wish there was a smoke platform. That would be pretty cool. Laser? What? Wow! That's pretty cool. Alright, alright. And then we got confetti and bubbles. Okay, what have we got underwater now? We've got the different uh, rings. Sorry, the different uh, like effects. Um, ow! Mist. Ah, oh, mist. Ah, interesting. Splashy, splashy. All right. Yeah. Rings. Very nice. What else we got? Electricity. Uh, sparks. These haven't changed at all, have they? No. Yeah, no, those are perfectly normal. Uh, Flamethrower at narrow. What? Explosion. Okay, yeah, those haven't changed either. Okay. Alrighty. Uh, nature. Um. <laughs> we got some new, new trees. Dry dead tree. We can filter this by um, uh, region. So technically, I would. This was the uh, default one for the previous alpha. Uh. And then, of course, we have park with all the interesting topiaries. Aha, uh -huh, yes. And then desert with the dead trees and the brown rocks. Uh, tropical and deciduous. Okay, yeah, we got some deciduous ivy. Yeah, yeah, wall climbers, basically. Egg salad. And then some alpine stuff. And there will be more coming in the next... Uh, in the next, I guess, what, in the, probably in the beta. Uh, path extras, trash cans, very, very important. And, of course, benches, also very important. Um, props. Yeah, we had a look at props already, didn't we? Yeah, okay, we don't need to look at props. Building. Building is actually... <laughs> oops. Building is what I wanted to look at. Um... Because we have that new fairy tale theme, so we've got some really cool new pieces that like to align themselves to the ground, apparently. So, um. Some interesting walls. I mean, um. Some nice roofs, windows, the decorations are really cool, wall signs, eh. but um, uh, if you undo that, we get the, uh, the actual castle, which doesn't appear to be part of the fairy tale theme. I, w I wonder what theme it's actually attached to. 
No. 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 Well, that's weird. Hmm. So anyway. I took a little time and I... Uh, the other day I took off the supports for this and I put down these uh, rather fetching archways. I thought they, they looked pretty good. And then of course when the sun went down I discovered that it was very, very dark over here so I put down these, these lamps too. Uh, it is now my intention to build uh, a castle right here. And just a little one. You know, just like a welcoming uh, castle you are now entering Fantasyland or whatever it is, you know. Um, and then further down here we'll do, uh, we'll try and like transition it to uh, that, that village scheme. So I am going to work on that now. I figure once I get the castle in I can flush out with some more trees and this whole corner should look, uh, should look pretty, pretty spiffy. Hmm? Hmm. Okie dokie. So let's get on with making this impressive castle.
Right. I think I'm going to call that about it for the moment. That's definitely a, a beginning. It needs a lot of fleshing out. Add some details to it, some bushes. Uh, work on this backside here. Um, obviously add some vegetation around this backside. Maybe put down some extras. What the heck is a royal... Woo! Yeah, something like this. <laughs> you know, put down some extras, but... Um, you know, we got we got plenty of stuff to do. We got these we got these new tents that we can play with. Uh, treasure chests, obviously. Yay! And uh, uh, when we get down to the village, we've got these really cool new uh, new toys to play with. These barns and all kinds of stuff. So it's it's gonna get it's gonna get interesting. Alrighty, so I th think I am gonna call it about done with the castle. I'm a little disappointed. I would have been nice if these animated, but I kind of understand why that would be bad. <laughs> Getting a lot more guests through here now, since I've got this thing built. I need to put some more decorations over here. This, Whilst the waterfall looks pretty cool, it also looks a little blank with just this rock. Oh, I think I'm getting a cold. But the castle's come out pretty good. I flushed it out a little bit, added some walls, added some decor on the side here, added some insidey bits. Take a quick look on the inside here. There you go, just chucked a wall in, the door, nothing really too fancy. And the uh, little fountain on this side. Some more animatronics for the people to enjoy. Well, if they do enjoy. It doesn't look like it. Can't even line up for a drink shop. Yeah, the the I need to work on the drink shops. Um, Add it in this little bit here. Just to flush out the decorations around this area. I thought it looked kind of cool. Because this, otherwise this would just be wasted space. I don't really want to waste any space. I kind of have a plan for a ride or something in here. Potentially some kind of screwed up roller coaster or something. I don't know. Ooh, kind of a really cool view from here to be honest. Um, our, uh, obviously threw in some, uh, some topiary. Added some ivy on the side of the walls and some windows and stuff. And it's coming out okay. I'm kind of, you know, put these topiaries up with this wall here, this bush wall, uh, so I can transition out into what's going to become the village area, which will be the next episode, maybe. Uh, the next episode may actually end up being the uh, the jester. An idea for a roller coaster. Yeah, we'll do that. The next episode, we'll do one of the new roller coaster types, and we'll we'll build out something called the Jester. I have no idea what it is yet. We'll find out when I get there. But until then, I will see you anon.